One day, about 5 billion years from now, the sun will become a red giant as it runs out of hydrogen and enters the final stages of its life cycle. While this will be a colossal event for our solar system, it's nothing compared to red supergiant stars that, under intense conditions, eventually end their cycles by exploding in an event known as a supernova. About 640 light years away, there is a star so gigantic that if it were at the center of our solar system, it would engulf the orbits of Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, and possibly Jupiter. This massive star can be found in the constellation Orion, and it's one of the 10 brightest stars in the night sky. The name Betelgeuse originates from the Arabic Ibt al jauza meaning the armpit of the giant, referring to the star's position in the constellation of Orion, which was seen as a giant or hunter. Over the centuries, transcription errors transformed the name into the modern Betelgeuse, preserving a link to ancient astronomical traditions. Let's travel to Betelgeuse. Betelgeuse is 650 light years from Earth. With current technology, it would take us over a million years to reach it. Betelgeuse is an impressively large red supergiant star with a diameter that fluctuates between 700 and 1,000 times that of the Sun, making it one of the largest stars known in the Milky Way. To put it into perspective, if Betelgeuse were at the center of our solar system, it would extend beyond the orbit of Mars and possibly even Jupiter, completely engulfing the inner planets, Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars. This giant star is about 10,000 times more luminous than the Sun. If our eyes could capture all the wavelengths that Betelgeuse emits, it would be the brightest star in the night sky. The reason behind its colossal size and variable brightness is that Betelgeuse is in the advanced stages of its life. It's approaching the end of its stellar cycle, and at any time within the next 100,000 years, it's expected to explode in a spectacular supernova that will be visible from Earth. In astronomical terms, this time frame is just a blink of an eye. At around 10 million years old, Betelgeuse is a mature that has been burning its hydrogen fuel at an extremely rapid rate, drastically shortening its lifespan compared to smaller stars. In contrast, our Sun, 
a much smaller star, still has about 6 billion years left, making Betelgeuse a fascinating example of the extreme forces that govern the largest stars in the universe. As a red supergiant, Betelgeuse is in the final stage of its stellar life, where intense nuclear fusion processes are occurring in its core. Initially, the star fuses hydrogen into helium, much like our sun. As the hydrogen fuel depletes, the star begins to fuse helium into heavier elements like oxygen and carbon. Over time, this chain of reactions continues, producing even heavier elements like nitrogen and, finally, iron. When Betelgeuse's core accumulates enough iron, it becomes so dense and heavy that the internal pressure can no longer counterbalance the gravitational force trying to collapse the star. After a brief initial flash, Betelgeuse will grow increasingly brighter over a period of weeks, becoming billions of times more luminous than the sun. Its light may be visible beyond the Milky Way. This explosion disperses heavy elements into space, creating a shockwave that lights up the galaxy and potentially leaving behind a neutron star or a black hole. Let's head back to Earth before the light arrives. From Earth, the explosion may be as bright as the moon, potentially visible during the day as well, and could last for several weeks or even months. Eventually, it will fade into the darkness of space. This extraordinary event could very well be witnessed within our lifetime. However, we will lose one of the brightest stars in our sky. The constellation of Orion will lose a star. Today, we are observing a star that might no longer exist. If you enjoyed and learned something new here, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss the next Journeys into Space. Consider supporting our channel. Check how in the pinned comment. Every contribution helps keep our ship moving. Want to go somewhere in the universe? Write suggestions in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you on the next flight.